Hi, it's Adam Zala from A to Z Net Ventures, and today I want to tell you some more about microdata. In our last video, I showed you how we can easily create your microdata code for your name, address, and phone number and add it to your website. Um, today, I'm going to continue on the theme by showing you how you can easily verify the code that you've created just to make sure that it's all present and correct and that the search engines are properly able to recognize it. So I'm on our own company website page and if I just scroll down to where I've got the address, here it is. That's using microdata that I created using the free tool I showed you in the last video. Now, if we go to Google's testing tool, which you can find here at google.com forward slash webmasters forward slash tools forward slash rich snippets, we can easily add in the website that we want to test. There we go. Click on preview. And then here it shows you what it understands from the various bits of microdata on your page. Now today we're not concerned with this author information or publisher information. Today we're just going to concentrate on the name, business, uh, phone number and address. So you see down here, we've got this item here and it shows you the format as of being a local business, business name, ADC Net Ventures LLC. It's got an address which is item 1 which refers to this box here and you can see that it's referred to as a postal address and then we've got the street address down here uh, the city, uh, the region and the postal code and you've also got the phone number here so from this we can clearly see that Google and other search engines are going to easily be able to recognize our microdata code and that everything is correct now, might also want to verify a little bit further when well, I say verify or check it and that you can do by visiting your own Google Places page or Google Local Places page or now it's called Google Plus Local and here on our company local page you can see that it has our address written here and also over here now if we simply do a right click and a view page source and then if you hit on a if you're on a PC control F to use the find function and then if we type in well, we search for schema and if you look at the first one there that doesn't apply to what we're looking for so we click on next and this looks like it so you can see if we scroll across a bit you can see the schema markup, microdata markup here. And you can see there, look, it says it's a postal address. It's a bit of a style, but there's the street address. And, and then you keep on going, you've got the address country, region, uh, locality, and so on. So you could actually go along to that code and copy and paste that into your site and that will of course also verify here once you paste it into your paper, sorry, verify here and so that's it an easy way or two easy ways you can check that your schema code is present and is correct and is easily read by the search engines if you didn't catch the first video, then I suggest you go and watch that as well, just to get some background information and also some help with creating the code in the first place. Okay, thanks for watching. Um, I've been Adam Zala, A to Z Net Ventures. If you have any questions or you're interested in our services, please don't hesitate to visit our website at a to z netventures.com. You can email us sales at a to z netventures.com, or you can, can of course call us anytime at 713-701-1854. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.